Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I am so happy to see you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yes, you are appreciated. Thank you. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> yes, most definitely. One thing about it, on this channel, you don't never have to worry about if you are appreciated or not, because most definitely, you are always appreciated. Thank you so much. And I mean it with my whole heart. Thank you. Thank you for just taking time to check up on little old me. Thank you for just stopping by and wanting to listen to me. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Woo! I can finally, <laughs> cautiously, walk out into my garage. Um, haven't seen anything. Ooh. Mm. <sighs> but I am being very cautious as I go out and step. Um, hopefully <laughs> hopefully my strong confidence is going to come back quickly i know it will come i do but how quick that i don't know <laughs> but anyway i am just so grateful that i haven't seen anything um i've been raising up my garage every day um Hoping if something needs to leave, that it'll leave. <laughs> but anyway, I just been leaving it open all day and letting the sun come in. And I'm telling you, it is sweltering in there. Whew. Anything that can stay in there got to be a good one, especially if it's living. Mm. But I, I haven't been outside today. I've been in the house all day. <laughs> I'm telling you, when I go to work, I work so hard. And whenever we get breaks and stuff, I'm telling you, it's kind of like I really don't want to do a whole lot. Well, I don't want to do what normally we do a lot. But since um, um, the pandemic, we haven't really been doing a lot. So I've been just finding myself being home. And I know that's a great thing to do. But most sometimes I don't even go out of the house. Unless I'm going somewhere. Sometimes I may go sit on the porch. Because I do have some sun shades that I can let down on my porch to kind of keep the sun off. Because my porch is in the morning time. My back is the back side of my house is piping hot. I mean, you can't touch windows, glass, or anything. It is hot. And in the morning time, uh, in the afternoon... The front side is piping hot. You can't even, not sometimes when you're walking through the front door, you can prop it up with a portion of your body so you can get yourself in. You won't do that on my door. <laughs> that door will nearly take your skin off. Yes, it is just that hot. The whole front porch, everything gets extremely hot. So you have to catch mine during morning and evening according to where you want to sit or be so yes yes hot 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 and i have a huge tree as i told you before that tree don't do nothing the only thing that tree do is shade my my air conditioning <laughs> and it's huge and probably um want the other part of my house but that's it that's the only thing it does. But anyway, I've been I'm waiting on my lawn man to come, you all. Because you know how it is once you start seeing snakes and stuff, you want to keep the grass cut. We was talking about that the other day. Well, we've been having a lot of rain. So my grass is inching on up and he cuts it every two weeks. And most of the time, it does fine with him cutting it every two weeks. But now it's getting kind of high. My mama came over today. She said, isn't it about time you get your grass cut? I'm, like, 
I'm looking like, well, is he coming today? I said, well, I don't know if he's coming today. He may come Saturday. I said, I don't know. I said, sometimes I know when he's coming is when he pop up, but it still be like the two weeks, you know, when he comes. So, anyway, I am waiting because it needs to be cut. I don't like it now since I know about that for it to get up extremely high. I um, want to try to keep it low. I had to go out, you all. Um, there was another accident on my driveway, y'all. Get my grass growing pretty and another little accident happened. But went out, got some seeds, got some more soil, and I planted it and put everything down and watered it real good and hopefully now it doesn't look bad because i have it all leveled out and it's with the full of seeds it did rain some today so i didn't have to go out to um to water but on days when it doesn't rain you know it has to be watered every day so if i ever see rain in the forecast i won't water it i'll wait for the rain so i won't get it overly saturated because for some reason that side right there loves to hold a little bit of water that's why i come I'll be trying to build up that grass there and keep it thick so that it won't um, do that. Don't know if I may have to get a drainage system put in on that side or not. It's not severe, but I just don't know exactly um, what I would have to do. But hopefully we can get that thing worked out so it won't be like that. But um, so far, so good. It still really looks good. Um in that little area once it grows out real real pretty i'm gonna take some more pictures and post them so you can see i wish i could have had some um beginning pictures when it was all well i wouldn't want to show you that because it wasn't nothing but thick sloppy mud just mud no grass whatsoever just thick thick mud but anyway just so happy to have some grass there now and it looks really nice and it's trying to come on up. But I'm telling you, how many of y'all areas are still having problems with the school system trying to decide what, what they're going to do? Yeah, my area too. They got an A, B, they have an A, B, and C on different, on you know, what they're going to do with um, um, A being um, students coming to school and B being them coming and having some remote learning and then with C being total remote learning. So I guess they got to decide on exactly what they um what they're gonna do. They're supposed to be surveying um they're surveying parents and they got to survey um the teachers. So we'll see exactly how that goes. Comment below if there's some what's um some changes in your area. If you don't mind, I'm sharing. I know some of you live in different parts of the world, different states. So share. Share some things about your area. I would love to hear them, especially about the schools, to hear them to know exactly what um, is going on. Yes, I appreciate that because I want to know how things are going in all areas. And it's just, you know different governments different you know system set up they're doing their own things but anyway i hope that you all have been having a great day today i didn't ask you that first how rude and naughty of me <laughs> i hope that you are having a wonderful day today i do i'm having a great day i told you i've been in just relaxing Mm-hmm. Just and just you know, just kicking back, catching up on things, trying to just get myself together. Sometimes like I just don't have the energy that I need, but you know if I'm gonna have to boost up on them B twelve or not. <laughs> I'm trying to see. I don't wanna get too much B twelve in me, but and to just help me to do stuff. I do good to do everything I need to do, making sure that I'm exercising every day. I'm still eating right, eating right every day. So proud of my 33 pounds that I lost. 
Yay me! And you all are not sharing if you all are on this weight loss journey. I want to know how, how well you are doing too. That's encouraging to me to know that you are doing well. It's not all about me. I want to know about you too. You matter. You count. I want to know about you. I really, really do. I don't know how to pronounce. Um, there's a teacher. Um, that's my new friend. Oh, she is so kind. She is so, so sweet. I just don't know how to pronounce her name. But you know who you are. You know who you are. Thank you so much for being so kind. You are just... You, you are you are the best i just thank you you're so loving to all my other friends thank you thank you so much for all that you all do thank you to the ones who who comes back and show up i appreciate you i try my best to continue to show love i do i really really do but we know how that go right don't even want to make no comments on it. We're going to just keep showing love and being kind. I'm telling you, we're going to continue to do so. It, it all just, we're going to continue to show love and be kind. All right, you all. I just want to come up here, just do a little update, checking on everybody, seeing how everybody's doing. Give out some properly welcome thank yous. Yes. Yes. Because I... I'm just so grateful. Mm. I'm just so grateful for the ones who show up and the ones that I do have. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. And if no one has told you today that they loved you, I love you. I do. I truly and really, really do. Hope you can just feel it radiating. Mm hmm Hope you can feel it because I do. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you won't miss a single video. Yes. Thank you for doing that. I appreciate it. Go ahead on. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I appreciate you. Thank you. Don't be shy. You don't got to be shy. It's okay. Mm-hmm. I send the love back your way too. I, I sure do and sure will. But thank you so much for all that you do and always stay encouraged and blessed. Yes, and whatever you do with everything within you, stay free. As free as you can possibly be, stay free. Talk, release, and let go. Yes, talk, release and let go. See you in my next video.